everyone, my name is Rhea Shalbagaad, grade 11 of St. Timothy. This speech is entitled, The Water's Legacy. I am sincerely glad and honored to speak and present before you the importance and significance of water with a panoramic view. Within the reach of my voice, wherever you are, I am hoping and praying that you are in good condition and health. As we ponder and internalize this topic, it is my utmost desire to give a detailed information concerning the importance of water in a general way. Thus, we can obtain, find wisdom and knowledge necessary in our daily living. Water has a well-known and famous formula in chemistry called H2O or dehydrogen monoxide which means two hydrogen atoms and one oxygen atom. The primary role and most important function of this element are to keep our body hydrated and to help our body parts such as tissues and cells for proper functioning. There are two important and major themes concerning water. First, water is life. Water itself means life and there is no other form of life could possibly survive without it. Just imagine, a garden without flowers, it's lifeless. And a land without water is definitely a desert or wilderness. A body lacks of water, it becomes dehydrated and it is dangerous. It will gradually lead in losing a life. The famous quotation said, Water is the soul of the earth. Soul is the fundamental necessity of every form of life. If the earth has no water, it could be directly said that earth is dead. The major rule and function of water is to keep us alive. And everything around us that has life would be meaningless and utterly useless without the presence of water. Second, water is a means of survival. I truly believe majority would agree that a person can survive without loved ones but in less than a week can survive without water. Plants, animals, nature, and even mankind needs water. The perpetuity of life would be impossible without it. Every living thing around us consists of When there is no water, there is no rain. Without rain, nature would never be green and everything would be lifeless. Even the life of mankind would be in danger. In order to perpetuate life, water is a fundamental necessity. The grass of the field, flowers, and lilies of the garden and trees of the forest will be safe and certainly in good condition when water is provided. We humans need water in order to survive.